Hi, you guys. I'm back. Okay, so today I'm going to be doing a grocery haul. I have a little Aldi, Costco, and Target. I didn't get that much from Target. I'll even show you guys what I did, what I got that's not grocery related. Um, but today I'm coming with the grocery haul for you. If you are new here, my name's Anitra. I do weight loss vlogs, what I eat in a day. I am on a journey to lose about 40 to 60 pounds with keto. I am new to keto about three-ish weeks. And I'm trying to get in that thick section again and not that skinny section. I'm just trying to transition out of the section I'm in back to the thick section, back over there, because I've been I've been away too long. Um, but if you're new here, stay. You know, we welcoming over here. Just have a seat, girl, boy. You're, if you're coming back, y'all all right with me. You are all right with me. Okay, let me stop talking because I'll start talking and it'll just be too long. Okay, you guys, stay tuned for the video. Let's start with Costco. I do not have a lot of room in my kitchen, so I'm trying to do it the best way that I can with this little space I have. So I got bacon. It came in a four pack with the plastic, but that thing ripped on transit. I have some ground turkey, and this is the 93.7, zero carbs. This bacon, I made sure that it had zero carbs and zero sugar. You see that there? I got um, some whisk, some Parmesan whisk. I do like these. I usually get the ones from Aldi. It does have one carb. I'm all right with that. Um, organic roasted seaweed. These are the macros on them. I do like seaweed. I get it every time I go to Aldi. I get it every time I go to the Trader Joe's and I get it when I go to Costco. So I pick this up every single time. And that was even before keto. I just like the way it tastes. My son put these in there, these cheese and uncured bacon bites. What is the macros on these? I haven't even looked. This has, uh, <laughs> I guess that would be one net carb, but it has less than one fiber. So I would say this is two. So I I think I've eaten these and I don't know if they taste like the um the Starbucks ones. The Starbucks ones are good. I got some good old avocado eggs. And I got some more garlic. I usually buy the small ones from Aldi. But I go through that so much. I just decided to get the big one from Costco. I showed you guys these in um one of my vlogs. This is the coconut keto cluster. It has pecans, almonds, pumpkin seeds. And it is so good. I've opened it. I opened it on the way home. But these are the macros on it. If you can see that. Those are so good. Like they're almost like dangerous, really. And then I got these um, sparkling I zero sugar back there. I put one in the freezer because I want to drink it. It's hot here, you guys. It's like 106 degrees. Well, how much is it now? It's 95 degrees and it is eight, almost 8.30 at night. So I'm hot. Um, and then I got some paper towels. That is my non-grocery item. So that's Costco. Also, I got two of the super coffee. I've had the vanilla and the hazelnut before, but all they had was vanilla today. These are so good, you guys. These have one carb. And it has um, protein and MCT oil in it. Zero sugar, 80 calories, 10 grams of protein. I got two of those. And then I got two of these um, meal sport because they have electrolytes in them. So I wanted to do something and get more electrolytes in. So those are two grocery items. These are the things I get got that are not grocery related. I got this. This was not in the dollar section, but it was over there like by the, gro not the groceries, um, the... this stuff <laughs> so i got this because i have a jewelry box but i wear pins and stuff and i wanted to have something to put on my dresser so i could put my pins in like you know my pins that i wear on my clothes so i got that i got two four of these bowls i like these these are like 79 cent plastic bowls and i like the color so i got four of those i picked up some more deodorant i always wear clinical strength because i'm not trying to be out here in these streets called slipping I got some more got to be glue for my hair. And then I got some shoes. Guys, these are so cute. Let me show you. This. 
Look at these little sandals. I can get them out. I'm gonna get that box out of here. Look at these. Aren't they cute? Aren't they cute? They were 20 bucks. I love them. I have a lot of like flip-flop shoes. Not like janky flip-flops, but like nice flip-flops. But I wanted something that I could just slide on. And they fit my fat feet because I have wide feet. But they fit them. So I got that. That's Target. Not least is Aldi. Y'all, this is my store. I love me some Aldi. Um, if y'all don't go to Aldi, what, what, why not? What's the problem? Why? Okay, let's get on with this thing. So, I already told you guys about these. I like to do turkey roll-ups with this and put some cheese. When I, y'all, this, this turkey, and I don't eat lunch meat. Like, I'm not a lunch meat type of chick. But this, the flavor is unreal. I got two of them. Look, and I think I still have a half of one in the refrigerator. This is so good. And then I got some more cheeses to wrap it in. So I got some smoked Gouda. I think I just had regular Gouda. I've never tried that. This one right here is, I think, an Aldi fine. Mm -mm -mm. That just sounds good. Habanero Jack cheese. Monterey Jack cheese with habanero and jalapeno peppers. Look at that. Whew, that's going to be good. And then I got some Kobe Jack. Nothing there to see. I like to, um, when I um, go to work, if I'm in a rush, I like to do the cold brew coffee real quick. So I got two of those. I got the signature blend and the barista blend. So I, I got, got two steaks. Oh. I got a strip steak and then I got a ribeye. And then I got um, two sparkling waters. I'm trying to get back into, into sparkling water. So I got a pomegranate flavor and I got a black cherry things i got was some hot and spicy pork rinds these are my favorite y'all with some hot sauce and i got the original but i got these because i'm gonna be making some um chicken strips this week and um i like to crunch these up and then like do an egg wash and put them in the air fryer with this on them so i'm gonna do that and then i have bought two butter and this is like the aldi version of the uh you know what's that one the grass-fed butter that I don't buy that one. This is it. So I picked up two of those. I forgot to show you guys these because I put these in the freezer when I got home. I got three of the keto ice cream. They're five net carbs. Um, this is the macros on that. But I got the peanut butter fudge, the cookie dough. I I um actually scooped a, a spoonful of it just to taste it, and it's good. And then I got mint chocolate chip so i got three of those i was surprised to see any kind of keto stuff in my aldi because you guys know the situation with the bread like so when i saw these i picked up all three flavors I, was it a third flavor i don't think so i think these are the three flavors okay, you guys, so that is the end of the grocery haul i'm tired i'm even sitting down at this point um again if you're new here welcome Go ahead and like the video, subscribe. As I said before, we cool over here. Um, I do appreciate all the comments you guys give me. It ain't much, but the people that do comment, I appreciate your comments and your kind words. Um, until next time, you guys, I will. <laughs> That's all I got. That's all I got. I'll talk to y'all later. <laughs>